soul. Poor unfortunate soul. Hmm. Who could be interested in such a thing? I'm sorry, but I don't have any room for that in my collection. Although, maybe we can find some use for it. I've heard somewhere that there is a way to free the soul by performing a special ritual. I think you just need to put that thingy in lava. No, water. Then put a gift next to it and sprinkle purification powder over it. What? I don't know what's going to happen. Just go and check. That's uh, pretty interesting. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to modded Terraria. Uh, let's just go over here. It's windy. All right, let's... Uh... Whoa. The Well of Souls. The Well of Souls here. Go in there. Here's your gift. A little bandage. A little bandage. There you go. And then... <gasps> That's amazing! Okay. Stairway to Heaven. Material. Gives invincibility for a few seconds when using healing potions. That's awesome. It's just like this. Except now, we can switch this to that page because the uh, Horn of Plenty has a 30 second duration. 30 seconds of potion sickness. So that's great. Equipable material. Hang on. The seventh element temporarily increases life regen when using healing potions. Shares healing potions effect between allies. Okay. Increases efficiency of healing potions. Provides life regen and reduces the cooldown of healing potions. Gives invincibility for a few seconds after using healing potions. Automatically uses a healing potion re when receiving fatal damage. Eventually, we will get all this other stuff. But that is amazing. The ritual is complete. <laughs> I love that so much. Uh, mm, okay, just going to keep that over there for now. And I'm going to make this black pearl. Uh, I don't know if we're going to fight this today, but it's potential. There's some potential there that we might. Black pearl. Right here. I just want to get that made. All right. Uh, we'll keep that there too. Put some purification powder away in here. And now, okay. We're going to rename you real fast. There's a couple things we're going to do before we get to business. Get to business. So rename pet. Uh, we're going to name this pet Marky. Because of this amazing comment by Dr. Pepper right here. So we got Marky the Vampire. There we go. Marky the Vampire Bat, I mean. Anyway. So, oh, and there's a Blue Jay. Wait a minute. Hello, little Blue Jay. <laughs> Blue Jay T Gaming, huh? Perfect. Forever my captive. Okay, now, before we get down to business here, we have to do something a little bit drastic. Uh... <laughs> Because I need, well, let's just say that uh, sacrifices must be made. We got one. Okay, so I got one. No problem. It didn't take that long. I was uh, getting a little worried there that I was going to lose a bunch of money. I lost a few gold. It's fine. Because I can't make these right here. I can't make these. With any mod that I have, we had to, uh, I guess, buy one with our lives. Get out of my way, chicken. Hello. <laughs> we had to, uh, yeah. So, here, now I can put this back on over there. And let me grab some glass and things and uh, put my, here, let's use this right here. There we go. Put our money away. Grab this again. And I guess here, we could put, hey, oops, these two away. And we grab glass, actually. Uh, boom. Perfect. And now, over here, uh, we'll do it on this side. I think I'm just going to go straight up from here, probably. Uh, do I want it right above it? We'll probably do like one space above. Get rid of this. Yeah, that looks good. We need that space between there. Because last episode, I hid Nomi. Or actually, I didn't hide Nomi. Nomi went on a little vacation again. And uh, XX 
Richtofen was the first person to spot him. And uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to work them all the way up and around eventually. Like a shield, a protective shield around the statue of Nomi. This is not Nomi, it's just a statue. Anyway, uh, now I'm going to grab a bunch of materials. Well, some. I just want to make some rooms in the desert base. And uh, get some NPCs moving in over there. Or move them from the top little planetoid area over to here. Just a few. Or as many as I can squeeze in there right now. I'm not going to really decorate them, I don't think. Just uh, I just want to get some rooms made. Anyway, let me do this. Alright guys, so we have, I think, 28 houses total over here right now. I don't want to do too many, uh, because I don't want it to be just like one giant, like, block of houses. It kind of already is, but that'll have to do for now. Uh, so yeah, we got eight on this side, eight on that side, and then we got some in the middle, too. And I, uh, yeah, we got blue right here in the middle of there. I don't know. It's, it is what it is for now. We are going to go and do something else now, though. Uh, let me just put my materials away. I'm going to be adding a lot more detail to that over time. B wall variation, block variation, and all that. Uh, hang on. Go away. Thank you very much. Uh, and I'll make it look better. But for now, there's much more that I want to do. Oh, uh, here. Let me take that out of there. Because I got these workbenches now. Alright. Let's see. Uh, ow, ow. Let me just put this right here. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Now, I do probably... It's time for this. It's time for the Grim Pointer. Which points down in this direction. We're going to go and fight the Viscount. Oh, what is this? Counter... Per oh. Okay, wait, what is that? Convert. Place an item here to convert it into its counterpart. Oh. Oh, so, wait a minute. Wait a minute. So, like, mushroom, uh, vile mushroom. Hey, come back here, buddy. Convert. No. Whatever. Maybe it only works on ore or stuff like that. One of the things I want to work on soon, oops, is... A, uh, did I buy that? <laughs> One of the things I want to work on soon is a auto potion crafting lab using mech transfer and a bunch of other. Uh, here, we're going to summon heart reach. A bunch of other mod wiring and building. Is that it? Health and mana, combat, other. Mm hmm. Let's get thorns. I think that'll be it right there. All right. Yeah. Anyway, so I want to build like a, a lab that crafts potions automatically for me. I'd rather do that. And that's a build that I've been wanting to do for quite a while. Uh, all right. So we're going to go down into this cave right here. It's a build I've been wanting to do for quite a while. And I want to finally get it, like, start working on it now, like, in pre-hard mode. Ow, oh, stop it. Ah, I forgot I don't have a weapon equipped. I'm using the pointer. I'm, like, clicking, trying to attack these things with the Grim Pointer. There, we got more of the Frambrosia. Give me that stuff. Ooh. Brazen Scale. Increases dark damage resistance by 10%. Even after years in the Marble Caves, this thing still shines brightly. And then a gladiator's locket. Summons two spirit swords to protect you. What? What? It gives me five more defense. And it's a material for that. Okay, whatever. Keep that on. And uh, we don't need the rock wings on down here. Can I please get out of here? Thank you. Oh, hello. Marble chess horse. Uh, here. Woo! Ah. What is this thing? What mod is this from? Hang on. Uh, let's just use this. Or this. 
get. We got all the bees. What is this thing? Tundron Tunneler. What is that from? From Pinky Mod. Okay. Come back here. I need to kill you over here. Boop. And ow, ow, ow. That hurts. I need to heal. Wait, so we have that. Okay. Did it drop anything? Like. Ow. Oh, it. Ow. <laughs> Ouch. Here, let me just move everything. Bismuth. To this page. Okay. I don't see. Oh, it's still around. Do I have to, like, destroy all of this? Uh, oops. Huh, that's really weird. It just, like, sticks around as, like, a trap. Anyway, I know we're gonna miss a lot of these life crystals and maybe even potentially chests, but it's fine. I'm going to be working on this world for so long that, uh, you know, every square inch is going to be explored and re-explored many numerous times. Like this. Gladiator swords. In fact, let me... Take you out and you. All right, perfect. And I don't know if, seems like uh, Sane has been, nothing happens. Oh, that happened. Let's say nothing happened. We got five gold. I need all the gold I can get. Good, we're refreshed because of uh, using a bunch of money recently. We got a king, hey, king statue. I don't want bombs. You could have the bombs. Trash. So now it's pointing a little bit less down. Let me get Sane out again. I don't know. Does Sane just keep. Oh, it's right here. It's right here. Does Sane keep despawning? Ow. Get all this ore. Lid. Pick it up. Ow, man. That thing is painful. Thing hurts. We got some dragon lead. You know what? You go away. You didn't drop anything anyway. I don't think. Probably has a chance to drop something really good. Some really rare ultimate weapon. <laughs> the ultimate weapon of the frigid wastes. Alright. So. Oh my god, it's back. It doesn't despawn. Fine. Come here. Come here. You're gonna get punked. Right in the face. Come on. Ow. I'm gonna get punked. Here, let me drain this water. I have the sponge. So I could just soak it all up, but... I'd rather just do this. I can't heal. I already healed. Now let's just dump it all right here. Into the lava. Make a bunch of obsidian. Where is all this? Wait, what was that, too? There's something. Hmm. Something was up there. There we go. Now it's finally draining. I just don't want to flood my arena over here. Okay. So, yeah. These are all going to break anyway while I, while I fight. So might as well break all these. And... Collect all the loots. Uh, let me go back again. Dump all this in there. Oh, the potions went in my... There. Mana. And Spelunker. I'll use a Spelunker. Why not? Okay. And... Let's... Do that. Okay, we got buffs. I'm a little nervous, but it'll be okay, right? It shall be okay. And silver bullets... Bombs, which... You know what? Let's sell them real quick. Whoa, what is that? Did I just... I summoned that. That's strange. Fairy merchant was slain. What the heck just happened? That was really weird. Okay. Um... <laughs> we have a little bit of, uh... Some bugs. Interesting. Alright. Anyway. So, we already have campfires here. Wow, you guys look cool. Got some kind of slimy slime up there. Uh, let me put a couple of these down. One over there. One over here. 
And then, uh, here, let's just put this down here. Perfect. Right there. Excellent. And we're going to use, I don't know how long these last. Let me use 14 of these. And they should, they stack up to 20 damage and crit chance. And, all right, buff. It didn't use any of these. What's going on? Oh, because it used the other thing, didn't it? No? I have enough? Oh, it did buff. Nausea. Oh, I ate a bunch of food. What is going on? What is all this? I got too many buffs? That's why. We have nausea. Lowered mana regen, slightly lowered damage, increased thirst drain rate. Whatever, it's fine. Wait, slightly lower damage? No way, man. 14% increased damage. Okay, let's just do this. Uh, while we're fighting, I'll try to buff. Anyway, let's go. The Viscount is here. Where you Oh, hello, buddy. Can I deflect your projectiles? Let's see. Ow, I cannot. Aw, oh, man. All right. So, let's just do this. Ow. Just do this. Just do this. This is what I want right here. Oh, but I have no juice left. Ow. This guy hurts. Why can't I heal? 17 seconds? Okay. I love this boss, though. The way it, like, the music and everything. The way it looks. Very cartoony. It's super cool. Thorium. Alright. Uh, just jump over those things. That makes me sad. I wanted to deflect these. Maybe I shouldn't get hit by them, though, because... <laughs> uh, okay. Does a lot of damage. Let me get Sane back out. Thank you. Do I have my other guy here? Hang on. Wow, lots of blood now. Uh, Alright, let me use that. I can't use that. Let's use this. Nice. Excellent. Uh, okay, marshmallows. You're gonna land? Oh, no, 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 ow! He's got the... boulders. Hey, stop that. That hurts. Mm. Yeah, we don't need the book barrier at the moment. Uh, more of this. The Knight of the Eyes. No! Oh, I got turned into a... That's right. Turns you into the bat. Oh, this is gonna be excellent. Excellent. This sucks. Uh, it, not if I die. It's not gonna be excellent if I die. Alright. Get this. Some of this. And we did it! World record. <laughs> of course, now it's Night of the Eyes. Uh, well, not down here, right? Seems like we're safe. I love this little arena. I love this boss. I'm very happy that we did not die. And we got a strong chain knife over here. I think I may have had a chain knife already, but it's fine. Anyway, awesome. That was weird. We killed the fairy merchant with a summon. <laughs> All right. Uh, what are these? Oh yeah, expeditions. And we didn't. We did it without any of these buffs too. Because I have like builder. I guess from food. I gotta make sure that I remove them, or I could guess I could just like manually buff. Anyway, so let me move this over to this page. Three. Let's actually let's get out of here first. We shall see each other again. Now, can I take this? Let me just leave it here for now. I may make a build out of this. I don't know. I really like this thing, though. Anyway, so, uh... I gotta just cancel the Night of the Eyes. That was kind of weird. Real quick. Yeah, I've been noticing the game's been kind of laggy lately. I mean, I am using the beta version of T-Mod Loader. Like, it's really laggy. Look at this. What is going on? Like, it's bad. Let me leave, just in case. I don't want to lose any progress. Alright. There's a fixed... Yeah, it seems a little better. But I've been noticing that it's, like, pretty laggy lately. Um, okay. Let's just... Now I'm in the way. <laughs> 
Chain knife. Did I have a chain knife? I did not. What can I make with the... Hey. What can I make with the chain knife? Nothing. Just that. Just the barbarian's essence. Anyway, for now. Uh, three, two, one, and boom. And yes, we got the mount, the mask. Not the mount. The count mask. Yes. A mythical vampire scepter releases a vampiric surge of magic that steals enemy life. Stolen life is doubled when the caster is below 50% life. Nice. And then the unreal. We got a mythical and an unreal. What? That is unreal. Guano gunner. Poop gunner. Turns bullets into bolts of slowing waste. Ramps up in speed the longer you shoot it. Okay, I don't think it's speeding up. Sweet. So we'll probably use that too. And that's for the sharpshooter's essence. And that's for the palladium enchantment. But, importantly, very, very importantly, yes. Yes, I could fly. I could have these around me to do damage to things. Interesting. And I get to run like this. <laughs> Which I think is incredible. Anyway, alright, so, perfect. Uh, yeah. I think we're gonna get out of here for now. But before we do, let me put these back on, actually. I'll take that off for now. Gotta figure out what slot I wanna... Because I like having these on. We just didn't need them on underground, you know? Bwah. For now, I have to say a big thank you to... I think we don't have room here. Yeah, of course we don't. Alright, save. Uh, this one, right? Probably. Yeah, just go over to this next sign. I want to make sure I don't mess this up. Alright. Uh, Benito. Thank you very much. Thanks for the split, uh, let's see. The, what is it? Lost soul? Poor soul. And slash. <laughs> accessory infos. Thank you. I would have totally not ever found that. Like, Split has, like, that's some pretty interesting stuff. Throwing an item, throwing a poor lost soul, a poor unfortunate soul, I think it's called, into water, and then putting an item, I think, above, it's got to be green rarity or above, <clears throat> and then sprinkling some purification powder on it. That's crazy. And then it turns if we freed it. That was amazing. Give me some marshmallows. Yes. Thank you. Anyway, guys. Uh, thank you all very much for watching. Next time, we got some frost plums. Nice. Next time, we're gonna go... Let me eat. Well, no. We don't even need to eat. It's perfect. Oh, because I did... I ate when I buffed. Pressing B eats food. That's why... I had nausea and all that because I actually ate one of these. Yes, I did. Okay. Anyway, whatever. Uh, next time, I think I'm going to fight the Black Pearl event. Or the, uh, not the Black Pearl, the Tide event. Which is one of my favorite events. Love that. I think we are we can fight it now and it's not going to totally destroy us. I think there's a pre-hard mode version and a hard mode version. This is amazing. Just gotta fix those little sprite sheet lines at the top. It's fine though. <laughs> no problem. Anyway, alright. Yeah. And I could even double jump with this. It's amazing. Thank you all. I'll see you next time. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>